Dr. Jemison. Hi, Dr. Jemison. Hello, Hello Dr. Dr. Jemison. Jemison. Three, two, one. Blast off! Go space, go space, go, go, go space. I grew up during the 1960s and the United States didn't have women astronauts. There were no people of color in the astronaut program. I just assumed I would go up. Why did you want to be an astronaut when other women were doing it? Because I wanted to go into space. <laughs> it's really quite simple. So that was one of the jobs I could do. I just wanted to be a scientist. I wanted to learn about the world. And I always assumed I'd go into space. Now my question for you is, what did you do to become an astronaut? Bye! Being an astronaut, you have lots of different things to do. You have to take, learn how to do photography. You have to learn geology and geography. You have to learn how all the systems work. You learn how to fly. So it's this really varied job. We learn scuba diving, so it's very physical. And at the same time, it has a lot of intellectual components. What is it like to be looking at the universe knowing it never ends? I want you to do something for me. I want you to go outside and look up. Because you're looking into space and infinity. When you're up above the Earth's atmosphere, there's a little less light pollution. And so you see the, see the stars more abundantly. But remember, right now, we're on a spaceship. I felt connected with infinity. I connect, felt connected with the entire universe when I was in space. And I feel that connection now. And I hope one day you'll look up and do that as well.